Kendra here, Miss Kincaid. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. So it's not Wednesday, it's Thursday, but we're going to be posting our Wig Wednesday today. So can I get a yay for Wig Wednesday on Thursday? Yay! Yes. <laughs> so you guys, I don't know if you remember, but my last Wig Wednesday, I showed you guys how I got this hair. This is from her hair company. It is the Brazilian Kinky Curly, and I have two bundles and a frontal on this unit. They actually sent me three bundles, but I was able to get a full unit with two bundles plus the frontal. The frontal is pretty large, you guys. As you can see, you get a lot of parting space. So I did put foundation on the frontal to match my scalp. And yes, I will link the video here, um, the original video here of how I got this hair. And so we're gonna be revamping this hair. So you guys know I just be chopping stuff up. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna take my scissors and I'm gonna cut this hair into a tapered cut. So if you've been watching um, some of my videos on how I cut my hair, then you know like my technique and my routine. I like to section off the top of my hair because that's gonna essentially be the longest part of my hair. So I'm just gonna part off um, the top section of this hair and put it in a ponytail as you see. And then I'm just gonna begin to work on my sides. And the object here is to get the sides as short as possible, you know, so that you can get that tapered look. So I'm just taking my scissors and I'm going to town, honey. And uh, you don't wanna cut too short because, you know, you can mess it up. So I would say start off long and then gradually cut up to the length that you want at the end. So as you can see, I'm just working them scissors here, honey, trying to get the best shape um, in the front. And I'm following the same routine all the way around. Um, I'm also gonna wet this hair because I wanna see how it shrinks up when it's dry because it is kinky curly hair, so it is gonna shrink up. It's a little bit stretched right now. So I am wetting it to see those curls pop and to see if I need to really cut some more or if I need to hold off when cutting anymore because it's gonna curl up enough to and give me the shape that I want. So that's one side done, you guys. And as you can see, the back there is still super long. So what I do to, to handle that is I part the hair in the middle and the back, and then I take one side and I pull it, and then I just cut it to measure the front. So I'm just pulling the hair towards the front and I'm cutting it exactly where I cut the front so that it'll just mirror all the way around. Like the whole shape will mirror all the way around using that technique. And as you can see, I've already done um, the other side. I'm just wetting it down so that it'll curl up so I can see how short it is. And this is what I have so far, you guys. And you don't wanna cut the back too short because this is a wig, girl. There's 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 wig cap back there. There's adjustable straps back there. You don't wanna cut any of that. I kinda tucked it under so you can't see it. So now we're gonna be working on the top section of the hair. And I'm just basically pulling the hair and cutting at an angle going forward, as you can see here. And I'm just gonna continue to shape this hair into the way that I want it shaped. So I'm gonna be doing a lot of cutting, a lot of wetting, just to see how I want it shaped. So you guys continue to watch and see how I shape this hair. So this is my final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this restyling video. I had a great time filming it. I'm so happy to say now that I have a tapered wig in my collection, yay. So let me know what your thoughts on how I cut the hair and the end style. 
post them down in the comment section below. Check the description box for all information regarding this hair. And as always, I'll talk to you guys on my next video. Oh, before we go, you guys, hey, I will be in Atlanta this weekend, April the 22nd on Sunday. I will be in Atlanta at the World Natural Hair Show. So if you guys are attending the World Natural Hair Show, come by, stop by and see your girl. I will be with Aunt Jackie's in booth 951. We'll be there at two o'clock. So I really hope to see each and every one of you. I love you guys and I'll talk to you on my next video. Bye.